Hey guys, how's everyone doing this morning? It's Pete. Um, I guess everybody's, uh, I hope everybody's doing well, um, especially for a Monday. I know Mondays are sometimes uh, a little difficult uh, to get started and get going. But, um, well, I guess we'll get right into this one. Um, actually, this is, this is actually in my opinion, a pretty special video. Um, if you're any kind of uh, traditional uh, knife guy or you like traditional knives like myself, um, you're, you're going to find this video pretty, you should find this video pretty interesting. Um, I myself is a traditional um, knife nut. Um, I just can't get enough of these things. They are just, I mean, to me, uh, this is the cat's meow to me in the cutlery, uh, world and in the cutlery game to me. Um, I've said it time and time before, and I'll keep on saying it, um, for anybody that hasn't heard me, these are my favorite knives to collect traditional knives are my favorite knives to collect and when i come across um a good one boy i'll tell you i'm excited as all can be man i get so excited and um well smoky mountain knife works just came out with this new line of queen knives i'll show you the box quickly this is the box it comes in. It comes in a, um, a magnetic box. I mean, very nice, very, very nice presentation box. Uh, really nice magnetic box. So you're getting that in with your purchase and just fantastic stuff. So as we all know, years ago, Queen was made in Titusville, Pennsylvania, and, well, it was a U.S., Queen was U.S. made, you know, through and through, you know, you couldn't mention Queen not knowing that it wasn't produced in, um, in the U.S., you know, Titusville, Titusville, Pennsylvania, but now, not so much, that's all, those days are gone, these here are produced in China, um, I guess Queen did whatever they did. I don't know the whole story on it, but I, I really don't even care. But the bottom line is, I just want to let you guys know now that they are now being produced in China. No longer U.S. So, if that has anything to um, do with, uh, your per purchase, then, you know, so be it. Um, but saying that I have never, never have I got a traditional knife from China, from China that as, that is as good as these queen knives are. They are just absolutely incredible. I have never... I, now, guys, I have high-end pieces of cutlery, which you all know I do. I have many a knives with saw-cut bones, covers on, on them. I have never came across a saw cut bone that is like that. These knives are, how shall I say it? Um, for the money, for the money you're paying for these. This is the, um, look at this. This is my favorite one yet. This just came in now. Uh, they just came this morning. 
this one is just, oh my God. I mean, it's a real, you got a beautiful, beautiful satin, a nice satin blade. Um, you could see, you could see how it's done just so, you could see little grind lines in it. It's done so well. Um, match strike pulls on them. Uh, you get your little queen right there on the tang. It says queen. And on the back right there, I do, yes, it says China. And the number, um, and the one you're getting, the, the number. But, I mean, they are just striking. I mean, look at, look at the ends, how they come to the end. Look at that saw cut bone. Um, the shield, look at that shield. The shield is done just, I mean, the shield is done as good as you can get this piece for, I mean, now I think this one, uh, this one was like 14, no, was this one 20? Oh, I have to look at the, uh, let me look, uh, let me see some guys. Bear with me here. Let's let's figure this out together. Let's shoot some prices at you, if I may. Uh, the Warncliffe, yes, that was sixteen dollars. You tell me. You tell me that you wouldn't pay sixteen dollars for this. You got lined bolsters. Look how beautiful. Look how beautiful those bolsters are. Again. Let's keep studying. Let's keep looking at that saw cut bone. Okay. Action is fantastic. Um, so you got this one here. You've got the Warren Cliff here, which comes in at $16.99. Tell me that's not that that don't blow your mind to pay $16.99 for look at what you're getting. You have to realize all of what you're getting here. It is just mind-blowing. Um, they do need to get cleaned. Uh, you know I'm going to touch on it. Because if you want these knives to become anything, you know, you want to make them as good as you can. Well, you're going to flush the pivot and you're going to clean everything. We know that. The Barlow, I know that the Barlow is coming in at 20, I think. The Barlow is coming in at $19.99. It is just absolutely, guys, it has no markings on the uh, bolster, which we love. We don't look at that. Now, look at a night, look at a Barlow that's done without that big R written on it. Look how beautiful, beautiful. Look at the backside of it. I mean, it's just, like I said, you got lined, they're all lined bolsters. All of them are lined. You got a beautiful shield here that they put on all of them. Um, They're just really, um, they're really, uh, impressing me. Um, I just might finish out the set now that I've got these in. I've got most of them. I might as well just finish the set now. There's no sense in me not going back and finishing up. I think there's like three more I got to pick up. To complete the whole the whole series. But look at that Barlow. Look how beautiful that Barlow is. That'll just not that's knocking me right out. That's knocking me off my chair, ladies and gentlemen. I'm just being honest with you. It's putting me, it's <laughs> it's knocking me silly. It is really knocking me silly. I should have picked up the rest of them. Why didn't I? God, this one is the Stockman. 
This is the Stockman. The Stockman is coming in at 19. The Stockman's coming in at 19.99 as well. That's a $20 bill as well. Look at the fit and finish on that back spring, uh, spring, that back spacer. Guys, the knife is put together. I mean, you can't ask for anything more than this for the money you're paying. Come on, guys, you're looking at a $20 bill here. You're looking at a $20 bill. This thing is just fantastic. I mean, uh, uh, guys. <laughs> You don't really have to uh, listen to me. I'm trying to work around the camera. I apologize. Let's get it opened. This one, I want to show you the backside on how beautiful it is. You're going to run out right now and order them all. Look how beautiful. Look how beautiful this Stockman is, will you? I'm a big, big Stockman fan, guys. I love a nice Stockman. Let's show you the back of this one, how this one, look at the fade on the, look at this um, saw cup bone, how it fades, that color fades to the lightness in that. Is that not just the most beautiful thing that you have ever seen in your whole entire life? Look at that saw cut bone, will you, for the sake of love? They are just fantastic. Look at the um, the satin blades, how beautiful the blades are, satin. Look at it. Look at them blades. Look at this nice big clip on here, how they did this clip on the... Uh, on the main blade. You got the pen, little pen blade here. They all came very sharp, which I'm very, very impressed with. They're all very sharp. The only thing I didn't do yet was, um, was flush the pivot and clean everything out. Clean the channel and do what I do with them. I just wanted to give you a first look at these. So that's that's a uh, the stockman. That's twenty bucks there. And um, the last one is the canoe, which I've already had, and just fantastic. Look at this canoe, will you? There's a series of them, guys. It's Smoky Mountain. If you go to Smoky Mountain Life Works, uh, there are, there's there's a few more that I need to pick. There's a Trapper. There's a Mini Trapper. There's a Peanut. There's a Peanut. And I think that there's one more that I can't think of right now. But they weren't really interesting me. I think I might just pick up the trapper. Um, I'll have to go back and look at what's left. But uh, I didn't really go for the peanut because I thought the peanut was too small. But it don't look small in the picture. Um, I don't know. I don't know. But you're not going to spend more than 20 bucks. Your highest you're going to pay is 20 bucks. And look at these things. Like I said... This is my favorite one right here. Look at how this is. Look at this Warren Cliff. I might, I might do a twofer. I might get enough. I like this one so much that I think I'm going to beat the living daylights out of this one and keep one pristine. So I could keep this one in, in a slip and in my pocket and beat the daylights out of this one and keep one uh, nice and crisp. Look at the back spring on it. Look at that. Guys, I'm telling you, man. Uh, yes, it's made in China. I understand that. Please, in the comments, don't beat me up that it's made in China and 
you don't care how well they're put together and this, that, and the other, and it's all junk and all that. Save it for the next guy. Save it for the next guy. I understand that. Your preference is your preference. If you don't like Chinese-made stuff, just move down the road. There's no... I understand. I get it. Believe me, I get it. You don't have to tell me. I get it. But I, I'm, I'm digging these, man. The money you can't... I mean, you can't beat what you're getting here. I tell you, if you're any kind of traditional knife guy and you get your hands on any one of these, yous are going to go bonkers, man. You're going to really, really like these uh, pieces from Queen. You're going to like these pieces from Queen. Holy cow. Oh, and if you don't believe me, Go watch Patty Potato Peelers. He's got a couple of... He bought a couple of them now, too. Uh, I think he just bought another one as well. Um, so, check him out. Um, he's He's got a video on these, too. Boasting about how he likes them. You know, he likes them a lot, too. So, all right, guys. Listen, I'm going to let you get down the road. We're... Uh, I'm always rushing this video because I know that people are, well, most people are not going to sit and watch a 20-minute video. They're just not. They're going to see what they see, and they're going to click you right off and move on. So, basically, you're sitting there talking to yourself. Let me know what you think about these guys, these queen uh, knives from Smoky Mountain Knife Works. Again, they are Chinese-made. But they are just some of the most fantastic pieces of traditional <laughs> cutlery that I've gotten in my hands. I'm telling you, for 20 bucks and Chinese made, I, man, look at that. Look what these Chinese people are doing. Look what, Look at this. This one's the one that gets me. It looks like a sunburst. Look at that. Look at that saw cut bone. I'm going to leave it here. I'm going to hold it here and just stop the video with that right there. All right, guys. Listen, be well. Be safe. Drop me a comment. Let me know what you think about these guys, please. I appreciate you. Thanks, guys. Take care. Be well. Thanks.